channel my name is Noel from IT7 University today I'm going to show you how you can solve this problem as you can see this problem is about constraint of motions and we can use the concept of stars and solve this problem simply the two the small slider a and b are connected by the rigid slider rod which means the rod is as a length of two r if the velocity of slider b is 2 meter per second to the right and it is constant over a certain interval of time determine the speed of slider a when the system in the position shown below we are given the velocity of slider b is 2 meter per second here and we are given here at angle 60 degree and this uh, connected member have the uh, value to r and we have this from this to here r over 2 and the velocity of p is in this direction and we can ask to determine the speed of slider a when the system is in uh, this uh, position like this when you can see the proof very good diagram of this equation we will get like this in this direction we have at an angle theta and the velocity of p is in this direction so the distance between from this to here is r over 2 this is totally r and here we have 13 degree we start 60 degrees here. Here we have 90 degree and totally 180 degree. This theta, which means uh, it has the same value as here, and we get alpha like here. So we can calculate the, the required value, which means the speed of uh, B, uh, the speed of A from the given equation. So uh, we are given the of P equals to the meter per second squared here, sine theta. As you can see here, sine theta is equal to opposite over. Uh, opposite over uh, 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 hypotenuse which means opposite of this value is uh, r over 2 which means uh, this out to this end Hi our hypotenuse is also 2r which means 1 over 4 then we get simply theta is equal to 14.48 after this uh, 13 plus theta which means 13 plus theta plus alpha we get 19 then alpha is equal to 19 minus 13 19 minus 13 minus 14.48 13 is already given here we get theta here 14.48 and from this we get alpha alpha is 45.5 degree okay by constraint the, the velocity of a times cos theta is equal to velocity of a times uh, sorry cos theta is equal to velocity of a times cos alpha then we can simply substitute the given value and we can get the unknown value simply so the velocity of a is equal to 2.756 meter per second squared so the speed of the slider a is the speed of the slider a is 2.76 meter per second so we can simply calculate the value of the speed of b like this next we'll do question number two if you like this video, make sure to subscribe our YouTube channel and share it for your friend. Uh, and uh, next, we'll do question number three from assignment six. Until that.